हेलो स्टूडेंट गुड मॉर्निंग आई एम डॉक्टर अजय कुमार सिन्हा प्रोफेसर ऑफ केमिस्ट्री टुडे आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस मैकेनिज्म ऑफ द रिएक्शन ड्यू टू डिस्प्लेसमेंट ऑफ ओ एच आयन और रिप्लेसमेंट ऑफ हाइड्रोक्सिल ग्रुप लास्ट लास्ट आई हैव डिस्कस्ड रिप्लेसमेंट ऑफ रिएक्शन ऑफ हेलोरिन्स इन दैट आई हैव डिस्कस्ड न्यूक्लियोफिलिक सब्सिट्यूशन नाउ आई विल कंटिन्यू रिएक्शन ऑफ हेलोरिन्स इन दैट आई एम आई एम गोइंग टू डिस्कस रिप्लेसमेंट ऑफ हाइड्रोक्सिल ग्रुप last class also i have discussed that chlorine atom is replaced by oh atom now its mechanism its mechanism i am going to discuss the presence of an electron withdrawing group like no2 at ortho and para position increases the reactivity of haloherenes what is its mechanism that i am going to discuss and uh, one more thing is there are no effect of effect on reactivity of haloherenes by the presence of electron withdrawing group at meta position it is affected only when it is present at ortho and para but there will be no effect on reactivity when uh, electron withdrawing group is present at meta position what are its mechanism now i am going to discuss and uh, this you can understand uh, very well only when you imagine now that uh, chlo- nitro chloro benzene just you have to consider no2 now suppose it is no2 is at para position para position with respect to cl cl is at carbon number 1 and no2 group group is attached at carbon number 4 in benzene ring and uh, alternate double and single bond is there in resonance that you know then now suppose near the chlorine bear chlorine is attached at that carbon double bond is there means car number carbon number 1 and 2 double bond is there and after that 1 and 2 double bond and then uh, Two and three single bond, and three and four double bond, five and six single bond, one and two double bond between carbon number one and two double bond. After that, carbon number two and three single bond, three and four double bond, four and five single bond, and five and six double bond. This is the situation of double bond. then here at carbon number 4 that is at para position no2 is attached and no2 its a position you are knowing no2 two oxygens are attached then uh, one oxygen have double bond with n in no2 one oxygen has double bond with n and other is single bond but one electron is one negative charge is there single bond is there but one negative charge is there then this no2 group this no2 group is attached to is attached to benzene ring at para position then now at this situation what will happen now suppose hydroxyl group is coming because this reaction will take place 
in the, in the presence of NOH. Then now OH, OH is a, just coming near the CL. We call only C substitution will be with CL. CL will go and OH will come at its place. You know that CL is negatively charged. OH is also minus charge. Then replacement will take place only there. At the place of CL, OH will go. OH minus and CL minus will come out. But how will it happen? That you can understand by mechanism. Now suppose OH ion is coming near the chloride. Chloride. Then now what will happen? That as soon as OH minus will come near the chloride, then because it is negatively charged, then uh, their negative charge will be more because Cl is also there. Cl is negatively charged. OH is also negatively charged. Correct? And uh, carbon is positively charged. That's why Cl is attached there. But now when OH will come, OH will come with negative charge, then there is a chance of a repulsion. A repulsion. But carbon is positively charged. Hence, uh, uh, who will give more electron? It will attach to attach to that that group. Okay. Then here, uh, OH ion, OH can OH can give easily. It can give the electron to the carbon. Hence, Cl actually is a competition. It is a competition. Both are negative. Cl and OH. Then now electrons uh, OH can give the electron very easily, smoothly, smoothly. That's why Cl will be replaced. Cl will be replaced by OH. Then what happens actually? That step wise, I will tell you how charge is uh, dispersing, revolving, or you can tell that moving charge is moving at uh, at uh, all three at three carbons means carbon number two, carbon number four and carbon number six, eh, this charge will revolve. It will, it will, uh, you can say, this thing's uh, electron will move, a pair of electron will move, charge will move through these carbon. Okay, that I want to tell you means charge will be delocalized, delocalized. Then uh, at first step, three step you have to understand. Then first step I am telling you, as soon as OH ion will reach near the CL, CL means, the, means uh, near the carbon through which CL is attached, then uh, now OH, uh, OH is negative, CL is also negative. Then there what will happen? Repulsion will be more due to negative charge. Then in that situation, double bond near that double bond is there. Carbon number one and two, that will be disturbed. That bond will break. Correct? And uh, now that bond will break and one pair of electron, what was the involved in? You can say double bond that pi bond electron will be disturbed and that bond will break and now at the carbon number 2 negative electron will come and that's why it will be negative then now with electron electron moved to the carbon number 2 and carbon number 2 became negatively charged then uh, that carbon will become positive charge Carbon number one will become positive charge because now that electron, electron of the first carbon, first carbon that is taken by just carbon number two, it came to the carbon number two. Then there it became positive charge because one pair of electron was there that was making a distance, a double bond. Then that electron is taken, came to the carbon number two. Then then uh, that carbon, first carbon become positive charge 
and second carbon will come negative charge correct then this carbon has now a pair of electron then now 2 and 3 this electron will make a double bond with carbon between 2 and 3 then this time when carbon number 2 carbon number 2 electron was there that will make double bond between 2 and 3 between 2 and 3 then uh, in second step what will happen in second structure you can tell electron is moving then uh, second and third uh, it is making double bond then third and fourth double bond uh, the double bond was there third and fourth then that will be disturbed then now that that bond will be break and with electron will come to the carbon number 4 electron will come to the carbon number 4 3 and 4 that bond will break and that electron will come to the fourth carbon fourth carbon will be negative then now you can see carbon number 2 became negative and carbon number 4 became negative then carbon number 2 means ortho position carbon number 4 means para position both are negative meta position no disturbance is there correct only double bond displacement then you have seen carbon number 2 and carbon number 4 became negative now after that what will happen that uh, this uh, carbon number 4 electron will make double bond between 4 and 5 4 and 5 then 5 and 6 double bond was there that will break then at carbon number 6 electron will be there and it will be negative charge then this carbon and carbon number 2 both are equivalent carbon number 2 carbon number 6 is equivalent that is also just like ortho position only and carbon number carbon number 5 is also ortho position uh, uh, this is meta position carbon number 5 is meta position and carbon number 6 is ortho position equivalent then now you can see that now car carbon number 6 is negative means third this is third carbon which is negative that is equivalent to ortho then in third structure you will find that now electron delocalized and uh, this reach to the carbon number 6 from carbon number 2 now it reach to the carbon number 6 then now what will happen carbon number 6 now negative charge is there negative charge is there then now oh is very close to that carbon carbon number 1 cl is also there cl is also there bond is became very weak cl and carbon bond became very weak and oh and cl this bond began to form began to form that is also weak and cl c carbon and cl bond is also becoming weak it is trying to leave and oh oh and carbon bond is forming then as soon as when carbon will electron will reach to the carbon number 6 third stage i am talking about third third structure then now because this carbon is electronegative carbon number electronegative means it has negative charge carbon number 6 is negative charge and there carbon number it is came came closer to carbon 1 carbon 6 is close to carbon 1 then how carbon carbon 1 what will happen more electron oh also has electron cl also has a negative charge oh also oh also negative charge and carbon number 6 also negative charge then due to repulsion what will happen cl will cl will go that carbon and cl bond will break and uh, that uh, carbon number 6 which was having one pair of electron and uh, that is a negative charge that will make a double bond between carbon 6 and 1 carbon 1 uh, and cl that bond will break then 
what will happen you can understand also because uh, this is a covalent bond everywhere uh, this uh, uh, pi bond is a covalent bond you know then actually in real sense all three carbon carbon 2 carbon 4 carbon 6 are becoming negative charge okay only you can tell what they have shared only that electron it has taken correct the electron what was it is shared in making double bond that only actually it will take that's why carbon carbon number 2 carbon number 4 carbon number 6 will come negative then now this uh, Uh, this uh, when it was a breaking double bond that time one electron was left with that carbon only as such for example carbon 1 and carbon 2 double bond was there then when bond broken then one electron was that one carbon one was having and the other carbon was having another electron correct that's why Uh, this uh, one electron is left with first carbon and another carbon and uh, one electron left with the first carbon and another electron just moved just moved uh, just uh, completely from 2 to 6 carbon number 2 to carbon number 6 it moved and wherever it went there it created negative charge then carbon number 2 carbon number 4 carbon number 6 is negative charge now at carbon number 6 because this carbon is negative having one electron then when cl will go then there it will when cl will go then uh, this uh, ag- um, there uh, it will cl- uh, this chloride ion will leave uh, then what will happen that now at carbon number 6 one electron is there and carbon number number 1 already one electron was there already one electron was there then both will make a double bond correct then in final stage you will get that now cl has gone and oh has joined oh and cl is just substituted same condition cl is going oh is coming then here you have seen that carbon number 1 and 6 double bond formed then see how you can say double uh, electron involved in double bond between 1 and 2 that is now delocalized means moved through moved through carbon number through all carbon you can tell but it became negative due to carbon number 2 4 and 6 2 means ortho 4 means para 6 means again ortho it has not affected to meta position means carbon 3 and 5 then this final step when bond will actually when electron will actually go that step will be fast step but these three steps are slow these three steps means three structure where when it was electron was moving the localization was going on these three steps they are slow step then in the beginning it will be slow step okay during the resonance uh, it will be slow and uh, when cl is leaving and oh is joining finally cl will leave oh will oh yeah, will join that step will be fast correct the moment when cl will leave oh will join after these formalities charge uh, delocalization de- at then at finally cl will go fast oh will join fast that step is fast step and finally you will get oh is joined oh is formed bond and cl is gone cl gone now you will get nitrophenol and plus cl minus chloride ion gone then this is the mechanism okay now i have told you when uh, no2 was uh, no2 was at uh, para position now when no2 will be at ortho position then that time what will happen when suppose uh, no2 is at uh, ortho position near to cl only 
means carbon number 2 no2 is there suppose there it is attached then now here now you have to understand now in this situation suppose oh is coming oh is coming then what will happen then here again situation will be the same situation will be the same means uh, double bond will carbon number 1 and carbon number 2 that double bond will break correct and after that it will make bo double bond between 2 and 3 again 3 and 4 bond will break break and it will form bond double bond between 4 and 5 and this uh, 5 and 6 bond will break double bond and uh, finally electron will reach to the carbon number 6 what I discussed same way but now here new things will happen that uh, that new things I want to tell you uh, other things are same here actually NO2 N and uh, two oxygens are there in NO2 the first oxygen is making double bond is making double bond N double bond N and O double bond is there and uh, other oxygen is single bond actually it was also double bond both oxygen was having double bond but when uh, you can say it will join with uh, when it will join with uh, this thing uh, carbon that time what will happen its a double bond will break one N and O double bond will break in that situation N will have a plus charge and oxygen will have negative charge now both electron is taken by oxygen now N is plus charge it is lagging it requires now electron because N is positive charge and because double bond broken then now electron is taken by oxygen because oxygen is more electronegative than nitrogen correct then N is positive that's why this N will actually this N joins the ortho position you know that at ortho position and para position electron will be available then now second, second situation you are considering that ortho position it is joining because ortho position also electron is available after breaking when bond will break then that carbon carbon number 2 will have electron and this nitrogen will join there at carbon number 2 then now here I am talking about NO2 then NO2 one oxygen is double bond second oxygen is single bond correct then this second oxygen is negatively charged negatively charged then now you know that in resonance what happens that which is a double that will come single single may become double correct because N was positive charge N was positive charge that then both oxygen was having double bond then anyone can break anyone can break then that's why that in a NO2 a structure we will see then double bond will become single bond single bond between oxygen and nitrogen will become double bond hence resonance will be there correct N and O one oxygen is a double bond other is single bond then other possibility is that now which was the single that will become double double will become single hence resonance will be there then here actually uh, that in NO2 NO2 group with some uh, uh, change is there means uh, when uh, carbon number 1 and 2 when this bond will break then carbon number 2 electron will come then now carbon 2 electron will come then what will happen then there because uh, carbon number carbon number I can say 1 that, that there it will be positive charge because now bond has broken and carbon number 2 will have negative charge then here what will happen new things that carbon number 1 is now becoming positive positive 
then uh, oxygen from NO2 oxygen from NO2 uh, that will actually first uh, in a temporarily in a temporary way it will make a bond uh, with that positive that carbon okay with that carbon it will make a bond in a temporary way temporarily then uh, now which has not attacked there which is outside only and uh, now at carbon at, at nitrogen only one oxygen will be there only one oxygen will be there which is negatively negatively charged this is negatively charged and one oxygen attached to the carbon which was positive there it attached only at that carbon cl is also attached correct then now this is the situation in the second step i mean uh, from when uh, no2 attached uh, after that i am talking when it is no2 attached at one, at the uh, um, means uh, at uh, second carbon ortho position when no2 is at ortho position that time this is this this situation will happen means uh, one oxygen from no2 will from that it will come and it will it will join to the carbon then now after that what will happen that now at nitrogen only one oxygen will remain and one positive charge will be there because ox because oxygen went to the carbon with electron then nitrogen already it was positive it will positive it will be positive only but now oh is there oh is very close correct planning to make the bond it is very close then what will happen there that in second step which will form the bond in the beginning it will form very weak slowly and slowly it will approach to the carbon then it will form bond weak that in the beginning it will be it will be weak only and that oxygen which which made the bond with uh, with carbon when oh will approach uh, the near that carbon then o will leave that place uh, and it will come to the original place uh, means with nitrogen nitrogen then now again you can say situation will be as it is means in uh, on nitrogen two oxygen will be there one double bond and one single bond single bond oxygen will have negative charge this is the only different after that again you know that uh, this uh, second carbon again uh, second between second and third uh, double bond will be there and then uh, this uh, third and fourth that bond will break and uh, after that uh, when third and bond third and fourth bond will break then electron will be able to will move to the or electron will be taken by the fourth carbon it will be negative means para position and this electron again it will make double bond with four and five then five and six will be disturbed six will have negative charge means what i discuss in the beginning same way delocalization of charge take a taken place negatively charge distributed okay from carbon number 1 to carbon number 6 and no2 position is as it is correct and uh, same way as the uh, chloride uh, this uh, carbon at carbon number 6 electron will reach then this electron will make a double bond and same time cl will leave and oh will finally join means uh, finally cl will go and oh will form okay then this step when this will happen finally cl will go and oh will join form the bond that will be the fast step fast step correct then finally you will get nitrophenol no2 at ortho position 
एंड ओ एच एट कार्बन नंबर वन ओ एच देन एंड सी एल सी एल विल गो आउट मीन फाइनल प्रोडक्ट द फाइनल लास्ट स्टेप विल बी फास्ट स्टेप क्योंकि सी एल विल लिव एंड ओ एच विल फॉर्म द बॉन्ड ओके देन यू विल गेट फाइनल प्रोडक्ट नाइट्रोफिनॉल प्लस सी एल वन माइनस करेक्ट देन दिस आई टोल्ड यू वेन एन ओ टू बिल वी एट पारा पोजिशन एंड ऑर्थो पोजिशन नाउ थर्ड सिचुएशन थर्ड सिचुएशन वेन एन ओ टू विल एट मेटा पोजिशन ऑलरेडी टोल यू प्रजेंस ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन विद्राइंग ग्रुप एट मेटा पोजिशन विल नॉट अफेक्ट और विल हैव नो अफेक्ट ऑन रिएक्टिविटी देन हेयर यू कैन सी थर्ड थर्ड कंसिड्रेशन यू कैन सी थर्ड सिचुएशन नाउ सपोज एन ओ टू इज एट मेट अ पोजिशन देन एन ओ टू मीन्स एन इज प्लस चार्ज यू नो एन एंड वन ऑक्सीजन एंड वन एन डबल बॉन्ड अदर ऑक्सीजन एंड एन इज सिंगल बॉन्ड एन इज पॉजिटिव चार्ज ओ इज नेगेटिव चार्ज दिस इज अ सिचुएशन ऑफ ऑफ एन ओ टू एटम्स ऑफ एन ओ टू नाउ दिस एन ओ टू इज ऑलरेडी अटैच विथ मेट अ पोजिशन यू कंसिडर नाउ हेयर वाट विल एपन अगेन बिगिनिंग विल बी द स्लो स्टेप स्टार्टिंग विल बी स्लो स्टेप बिकॉज ओ एच विल इज अप्रोचिंग टू द टू द कार्बन टू विच सी एल इज अटैच सी एल इज एट नाउ सपोज सपोज कार्बन नंबर वन सी एल इज अटैच वाट आई टोल्ड इन इन अदर टू केसेज हेयर ऑल्सो सी एल इज देयर क्लोरो बेंजीन दे नाउ अगेन सेम वे बॉन्ड विल ब्रेक फ्रॉम फर्स्ट बिटवीन फर्स्ट एंड सेकेंड एंड द सेम वे इट विल बी गेट रिवॉल्व बॉन्ड विल ब्रेक अ न्यू बॉन्ड विल फॉर्म दिस विल कंटिन्यू कंटिन्यू लाइक वाट आई डिस्कसड देन यू विल फाइंड दैट कार्बन नंबर टू एंड थ्री कार्बन नंबर कार्बन नंबर टू इलेक्ट्रॉन विल बी देयर एंड दैट इलेक्ट्रॉन विल मेक बॉन्ड विथ टू एंड थ्री टू एंड थ्री देन दैट विल बी डबल बॉन्ड टू एंड थ्री एंड दैट बॉन्ड विल बी डिस्टर्ब नाउ इलेक्ट्रॉन दैट इलेक्ट्रॉन बिकॉज कार्बन नंबर टू एंड थ्री सिंगल बॉन्ड वॉज देयर वन एंड टू डबल बॉन्ड देन कार्बन नंबर टू नाउ दे हैव इलेक्ट्रॉन नेगेटिव चार्ज देन इट विल मेक इट विल मेक डबल बॉन्ड विथ टू एंड थ्री टू एंड थ्री देन इट विल डिस्टर्ब फोर एंड फाइव मीन्स इट विल डिस्टर्ब दिस थिंग थ्री एंड फोर बॉन्ड पैरा बॉन्ड इलेक्ट्रॉन विल कम टू द पैरा पोजिशन देन अगेन इट विल कंटिन्यू वाट आई डिस्कस इन दैट वे दैन नाउ एफ सी जस्ट नाउ यू कैन सी दैट इलेक्ट्रॉन मूवमेंट इज एज इट इज एज इट इज इन ए रेगुलर वे वाट है the when i know to was at ortho and para position that way it will it has moved means carbon number 2 and carbon number 4 only was having negative charge meta position no effect no on meta position no negative charge no negative charge then same way this a complete delocalization of electron took place and finally last step will be fast step now cl will go which will join means delocalization of electron taken place and now cl gone completely and oh formed bond with carbon again you will get uh, nitrophenol but it is a meta nitrophenol meta nitrophenol plus chloride ion chloride ion correct then uh, this i have discussed mechanism okay question is actually asked same reasoning what i discussed on that basis question is asked why does no2 group so its effect only at ortho and para position and not at meta position already its explanation already i have explained now again i am briefing it that uh, now we are uh, You have seen all the things how the de delocalization is going on. 
then the presence of nitro group again i am briefing you the presence of nitro group at ortho and para position withdraw the electron density electron density density from the benzene ring and that and thus facilitates the attack of nucleophile or hyl on hyaluronic correct nucleophile means here oh minus then it facilitates the attack of the nucleophile on hyaluronic the carbon anion negative charge is called carb anion carb anion also or the shortcut carb anion the carb anion means always negative charge carbon has negative charge the carb anion thus formed is stabilized through resonance it is stabilized through resonance the negative charge appeared at ortho and para positions with respect to halogen substituent is stabilized by stabilized by no2 group while in case of meta nitro benzene none of the resonating structures bear the negative charge on carbon atom bearing the no2 group therefore the presence of nitro group at at meta position does not stabilize the negative charge and no effect on reactivity is observed by the presence of no2 group at meta position at meta position no negative charge you remember now i am discussing other properties that is uh, electrophilic substitution electrophilic substitution you now actually you are reaction of halo arene you are studying correct in that i am telling you in benzene ring okay halo arene then now here means uh, chlorobenzene in that situation you are studying that uh, electrophilic substitution nucleophilic i discussed now electrophilic electrophilic means e plus e electro this will come uh, electro electrophile will have positive charge then what is the example of electrophile then best example is no2 plus no2 best example means uh, any any group which have positive positive charge that is considered as electrophile then now electrophile substitution means now this plus will go and uh, like h plus will move and it's and in its place no2 will join plus no2 will join then in benzene ring h will be available h plus then it will go and that is positive and this is also positive hence from the, uh, that in the place of h e will come means ele- electrophile will come as for example no2 and then bond will form okay then this type of things will happen in electrophilic substitution reaction now i am going in details halo halo arenes undergo the usual electrophilic reaction of the benzene ring such as halo halogenation nitration sulfonation friedel-crafts reaction in all you will find that uh, all this group will have positive charge okay halo arenes undergo the usual electrophilic reactions of the benzene ring such as halogenation that time nitration that time sulfonation that time and friedel craft reaction that time electrophilic substitution reaction takes place halogen atom besides being slightly deactivating this uh, halogen atom is very very important halogen atom besides being slightly deactivating deactivating is a uh, ortho and para para directing halogen atom is a uh, deactivating slightly deactivating is ortho para directing also it is deactivating group but 
it will be uh, ortho para directing also halogen atom besides being slightly deactivating is ortho para directing also therefore further substitution occurs at ortho and para position with respect to the halogen atom the ortho and para directing influence of halogen can be easily understood if we consider the resonating structure structures of halo halo benzene halo benzene as for example same way what i have discussed same way that x is attached with the benzene benzene ring and near that carbon double bond is there what i have discussed same way earlier what i discussed same way then now again it will total total four structure you will get means now double bond will break and single bond will double bond will break uh, and next next with the next carbon double bond will make means there will be rotation of double means uh, double and single bond means double bond will break and it will form it will form with next carbon double bond okay alternate double and single bond position will change same way what i have discussed means carbon number 2 negative after that carbon number 4 negative and then carbon number 6 negative and when carbon number 6 negative will be there then that time what will happen actually here just it is important things that x means halogen have three pair of electron six six pair of electron lone pair of electron then uh, when will this carbon number 1 and 2 bond will break but uh, why it will break simply some reasoning should be there to break reason should be there then uh, reason is that that x uh, will donate one lone pair of electron it has three lone pair of electron then one lone pair electron it will donate and it will form actually it is joined with a single bond halogen and carbon is joined with single bond now because halogen has lone pair of electron hence one pair of electron it will give and that carbon which was which was single carbon and halogen by single bond it will become double bond double bond then now you can see total valency became 5 carbon number 1 and 2 already two bond was there and now it is making double bond then 2 to 4 and carbon number 6 and carbon number 1 1 one bond total 5 then it is it will be not balanced five balanced carbon maximum has four balanced but now in this situation it will be five that's why this is not stable most unstable then that bond double bond carbon 1 and carbon 2 between carbon 1 and carbon 2 that double bond will break correct and carbon number 2 will be negative will be negative because it will take electron will come to that carbon number 2 and after that again same way just uh, delocalization will take place and again when uh, electron will uh, negative charge will reach to the carbon number 6 then what will happen actually um, when carbon when halogen has um, that lone pair of electron given electron lone pair of electron has given to make a double bond that time because it has given one lone pair of electron due to that reason x got positive charge x got positive charge correct you remember that then now that uh, when uh, after the movement uh, uh, negative charge will reach to the reach to the can say x carbon number 6 uh, means complete de delocalization then what will happen because now here is a carbon number 6 carbon number 6 negative charge is there and uh, carbon number 1 already one electron was there 
एंड कार्बन नंबर वन कार्बन नंबर सिक्स ऑल्सो वन इलेक्ट्रॉन इज देयर दैट्स वाई इट इज नेगेटिव दैट्स वाई इट इज नेगेटिव दे नाउ इट कैन फॉर्म डबल बॉन्ड देयर देर कार्बन नंबर वन एंड कार्बन नंबर सिक्स डबल बॉन्ड विल बी फॉर्मड एंड देन अगेन दैट बॉन्ड विच कार्बन एंड कार्बन एंड एक्स वाज हैविंग डबल बॉन्ड दैट विल अगेन इट विल कम टू द नॉर्मल फॉर्म नॉर्मल वे ओके दे नाउ दिस विल हैपन वेन अदर इलेक्ट्रोफाइल विल कम दिस थिंग वॉट आई टोल्ड यू दिस रेजोनेटिंग स्ट्रक्चर टोटल फोर स्ट्रक्चर दिस दिस यू कैन से डिलोकाइजेशन ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन विल टेक प्लेस ओनली वेन एनी ई प्लस विल कम मीन्स इलेक्ट्रोफाइल विल कम हैविंग पॉजिटिव चार्ज देन ड्यू टू रेजोनेंस द इलेक्ट्रॉन डेंसिटी इंक्रीजेज मोर एट ऑर्थो एंड पारा पोडिस पोजिशन दैन एट मेटा पोजिशन फर्दर द हेलोजन एटम बिकॉज ऑफ इट्स माइनस आई इफेक्ट हेलोजन एक्चुअली हैज माइनस इंडक्टिव इफेक्ट माइनस इंडक्टिव इफेक्ट आई आई मीन्स इंडक्टिव माइनस आई इफेक्ट मीन्स इट विल चार इट विल क्रिएट चार्ज इट विल अट्रैक्ट द इलेक्ट्रॉन करेक्ट देन हेयर इट इज इम्पॉर्टेंट ड्यू टू रेजोनेंस द इलेक्ट्रॉन डेंसिटी इंक्रीजेज मोर एट ऑर्थो एंड पारा पोजिशन दैन एट मेटा पोजिशन फर्दर द हेलोजन एटम बिकॉज ऑफ इट्स माइनस आई इफेक्ट हैज सम टेंडेंसी टू विड्रा इलेक्ट्रॉन फ्रॉम द बेंजीन रिंग एज ए रिजल्ट द रिंग गेट्स ए सम वाट डीएक्टिवेटेड ऑब्वियसली इलेक्ट्रॉन इज टेकन बाई द हेलोजन दैन रिंग रिंग विल बी डीएक्टिवेटेड करेक्ट ड्यू टू दिस एज ए रिजल्ट ऑफ दिस एक्शन माइनस आई इफेक्ट है एज ए रिजल्ट ऑफ माइनस आई इफेक्ट द रिंग गेट्स ए सम वाट डीएक्टिवेटेड एज कंपेयर टू बेंजीन एज कंपेयर टू बेंजीन नाउट इज बिकम डीएक्टिवेटेड हेंस द इलेक्ट्रोफिलिक्स सब्सिशन रिएक्शंस इन हेलोजन ऑकर्स स्लोली बिकॉज इलेक्ट्रॉन हैज बिन टेकन then now less electron is available and electrophile is is coming to take the electron but their electron is becoming less less available because chlorine chlorine atom has taken the electron then on the ring availability of electron will be less hence reaction will be slow electrophile electrophilic reaction will be slow correct then uh, this I told you hell uh, this uh, electro electrophilic substitution reactions in halo al halo arenes occur slowly and requires more drastic condition and requires more drastic condition as compared to those in benzene. Because benzene situation only benzene, their electron was there, but when uh, when uh, this X group is attached, electron with drawing group is attached. Means uh, Cl is attached there. Cl minus is already attached. Then it will Cl Cl is attached. Then it will it is attracting electron. It is attracting electron when Cl is attached there. Then now situation is different from benzene. Benzene electron was there, but in this situation, due to minus I effect, uh, electron present in the benzene ring is now. less available for uh, you can say electrophilic substitution because that electrophile will come will come to get the electron and the electron is less available that's why reaction will be slow and that is the reason it requires more drastic condition as compared to those in benzene for halogenation okay then now you can see in the case of halogenation what will happen then chlorobenzene is there and now uh, one more chlorine want to attach there what will happen chloro chlorobenzene means chlorobenzene plus cl2 then 
हेयर फॉर इलेक्ट्रोफिलिक इलेक्ट्रोफिलिक आई कैन से सब्सिट्यूशन ड्रास्टिक कंडीशन आई टोल्ड यू इज रिक्वायर्ड देन हेयर व्हाट विल द ड्रास्टिक कंडीशन देन हेयर एन हाइड्रस ए पी सी एल ए पी सी एल थ्री विल बी रिक्वायर्ड इट विल रिक्वायर ए पी सी एल थ्री फेर एस ट्राई कोल राइड ए पी सी एल थ्री इन द प्रजेंस ऑफ एन हाइड्रस एन हाइड्रस नो वाटर इज रिक्वायर्ड एयर एन हाइड्रस ए पी सी एल थ्री रिएक्शन विल टेक प्लेस मीन्स क्लोरोबेंजिन प्लस सी एल टू नाउ इम्पॉर्टेंट थिंग्स एयर यू कैन सी वेन सी एल टू विल ब्रेक सी एल एंड सी एल बाउंड इज देयर देन इन द प्रजेंस ऑफ ए पी सी एल थ्री हेयर रोल ऑफ ए पी सी एल थ्री ए पी सी एल थ्री इज सी वाट हैपन्स वाट इज द रोल ऑफ ए पी सी एल थ्री हेयर दैट सी एल सी एल बाउंड विल ब्रेक एंड दैट वन सी एल विल टेक द इलेक्ट्रॉन वेन बॉन्ड विल ब्रेक देन वन सी एल विल टेक द इलेक्ट्रॉन एंड इट विल बिकम नेगेटिव एंड अदर सी एल विल बिकम पॉजिटिव पॉजिटिव वो विल लूज द इलेक्ट्रॉन दैट सी एल विल बी पॉजिटिव एंड दोज यू हैव टेकन इलेक्ट्रॉन विल बी नेगेटिव देन नाउ दिस एक्चुअली फॉर दिस सिचुएसन ए पी सी एल थ्री इज रिस्पॉन्सिबल करेक्ट ए पी सी एल थ्री यू नो दैट ए पी एस डी आर वाइटल एम पी डी आर वाइटल देन फॉर ए शॉर्ट पीरियड फॉर ए शॉर्ट पीरियड एक्चुअली दैट ए पी सी एल थ्री देयर दिस सी एल विल गो वन सी एल विच एज इलेक्ट्रॉन विल गो टू द डी आर वाइटल मीन्स इट विल फॉर्म फॉर्म यू कैन से फॉर ए पी सी एल फोर फॉर ए शॉर्ट पीरियड माइनस ओके देन ओनली ए पी वन प्लस ए पी सी एल सी एल प्लस विल बी देयर बिकॉज सी एल माइनस विल गो टू द सी एल माइनस विल गो टू द ए पी सी एल थ्री देन सी एल प्लस विल बी रिमेनिंग देन दैट सी एल प्लस दैट सी एल प्लस वेयर इट विल गो देन नाउ यू आर अंडरस्टैंडिंग देन एट ऑर्थो और एट पारा ओनली दिस टू पोजिशन नेगेटिव चार्ज इज देयर ड्यू टू द रेजोनेंस डी लोकलाइजेशन एंड दिस सी एल प्लस दिस सी एल प्लस विल गो आइदर एट ऑर्थो और एट पारा पोजिशन और बोथ प्रोडक्ट इट कैन गिव पारा ऑल्सो मीन्स ए वन फोर डाई क्लोरो बेंजीन दिस विल बी द मेजर प्रोडक्ट एंड अदर प्रोडक्ट विल बी वन टू डाई क्लोरो वन टू डाई क्लोरो बेंजीन बोथ प्रोडक्ट यू विल गेट बट पारा पोजिशन इज मेजर प्रोडक्ट एंड माइनर विल बी द वन टू विल बी द माइनर नाउ वाई पारा पोजिशन इज अ स्ट्रॉगर एंड वाई मीन्स मेजर एंड वाई दिस ऑर्थो पोजिशन इज समवाट माइनर माइनर इज पारा पोजिशन इट इज ए मोर विल गेट परसेंटेज विल बी मोर एंड दैट विल बी माइनर वन टू विल बी माइनर वाई माइनर वाई दिस वन फोर इज मोर प्रोडक्शन विल बी मोर क्वान्टिटी विल बी मोर देन हेयर यू अंडरस्टैंड दैट नाउ इन कंपेरिजन टू दिस थिंग क्लोरिन आइटम फर्स्ट फर्स्ट कार्बन आइटम क्लोरिन वॉज अटैच ऑलरेडी क्लोरोबेंजिन देन इन दैट बोथ सी एल्स आर कमिंग क्लोज बोथ सी एल कार्बन नंबर वन एंड कार्बन नंबर टू बोथ आर क्लोज एंड बोथ कार्बन बोथ क्लोरिन आइटम्स हैव लोन पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन्स बोथ हाइलोजन और बोथ क्लोरिन हैव लोन पेयर ऑफ इलेक्ट्रॉन देन रिपल्सन विल बी देयर रिपल्सन विल बी देयर दैट्स वाई दे विल प्रिफर that position where repulsion will be less then carbon number 1 and carbon number 4 just opposite they are far they are far then this repulsion will be 
negligible very very less negligible hence uh, it will prefer to join at para position but it can join ortho also but uh, that uh, that's why uh, it's uh, it will give less quantity that is the minor product more product major product will be 14 question is asked now come to the nitration nitration the nitration means suppose hno3 is coming hno3 actually in presence of h2so4 always you remember nitration means h2so4 is required here always not only hno3 h2so4 that also concentrated is required then you will ask why why concentrated h2so4 then see nitrous you are going to do nitration means you want no2 you want no2 then hno3 see the hno3 nitric acid then one h and one o hno3 you want no2 then one h and two o that that should not be there HNO three, then here what will happen? That uh, now this uh, two oxygen and one H is extra. You want only NO two, NO two. Either here it is HNO three. Then then now here one H and one O. That is the OH minus. You can tell is is there. Correct. If this OH will go, OH minus will go. Only then you will get NO two. To get NO two, OH should go. Then how OH OH will go? How OH minus will go? Then this will happen only when HNO three will will be close to the will be close to the ortho position. Ortho position or meta position, there what will happen? H is there. H is there. Then that H is positive charge. It will come out as positive charge H plus, and that carbon will become negative. Then this H plus and O H minus, it will form H two O. H two O. That H two O. H2SO4 will absorb. It is dehydrating agent. H2SO4 is dehydrating agent. Hence, when H2SO4 is there, then what it will do? This OH ion and H ion both it will absorb. To both H and OH will become H2O, and that H2O will be quickly it will be taken by means absorbed by H2SO4. It is dehydrating. it will remove the water then to form the water h plus is coming from the benzene ring and oh is coming from the hno3 then now what you got plus no2 you got now plus no2 because see hno3 h is the h will come out as a h plus then no2 no we now will get no3 one minus but when one o will also come out no3 was there minus but when oxygen will come then in that situation now because oxygen is coming out one oxygen then nitrogen will get positive charge nitrogen will get positive charge because oxygen is coming with electron then now you have seen now you got no2 plus then this no2 plus now plus no2 it will attract to the carbon which is negatively charged minus carbon carbon is negatively charged there it will attack and it will form no2 same situation will happen when it will go to the para group okay h2so4 is required concentrated because it will due to this h2so4 only that uh, h h from uh, H from benzene and OH from HNO3 comes out and forms the water. 
due to the H2SO4 only and that H2O, H2O will be absorbed by H2SO4 because it is the dehydrating agent. It absorbs the water molecules. Then now like that way at ortho and at ortho and para position NO2 group can attach. Hence you will get both product. Major product will be 1,4 nitrobenzene and minor product will be 1 to nitrobenzene. Okay. Here also you can see that nitrogen means 1 and 2 carbon. Carbon number 1 Cl is there, carbon number 2 NO2. My minor product, why is it minor? I am telling you. Now 2 oxygen is there with air. N is also negative, electronegative and 2 oxygen is also negative, electronegative. All have lone pair of electron. Then again, and chlorine also have a lone, lone pair of electron. Then again, due to the repulsion, uh, they will not feel very stable. That's why they will prefer fourth position is para position. Okay. Now, sulfonation you can see. Sulfonation. Sulfonation means what? You want SO3H group. You want SO3H group. Then how will you get SO3H group? Then you will get it only by H2SO4. H2SO4. If from H2SO4, uh, how will you get HSO3? HSO3? Then OH group should come out. Correct? The, from here also, that uh, H2SO4 is there. You want HSO3. Then one oxygen should go and one H should go. Means OH should come out. Only then you will get OH minus will come out. Or when it will come out, then uh, what you will get? You will get H. SO3 then OH minus is coming out then here what you will get that it will be uh, if this uh, you will get SO3H which is a positively charged OH came out from H2SO4 then remaining rena, rena, on remaining molecule what will be the charge positive charge then S will have positive charge correct HSO3 that that you can say ion will have positive charge correct then now it is also positive charge I told you means it plus SO3 means it will behave like a electrophile E plus E plus now HSO3 HSO3 but S is now positively charged then same situation will happen that H will come out from the either from ortho position or from mm, uh, para position. H will come out. Then OH is already outside and H will come from the benzene ring. Then H, as a H plus it will come out. Then that carbon will come negative. You know, then H plus OH minus will form water and there SO3H will attach same way either at ortho position or at para position then minor position will be at ortho 2 chloro benzene sulfonic acid product name will be 2 chloro 2 chloro benzene sulfonic acid and uh, other will be 4 chloro 4 chloro benzene sulfonic acid correct 4 chloro because carbon number 4 SO3H attached. That's why it is a major product. Is it called 4 chloro? Actually, now SO3H has come. Then you can consider SO3H as a with respect to SO3. With respect to SO3, chlorine is at chlorine is at ortho position. Ortho position. Okay. And uh, Para position is para position is fourth carbon, fourth carbon. Okay, then two chlorobenzene is the minor carbon number two. Okay, 
and four chlorobenzene four chloro not benzene sulfonic acid is there then this respect to sulfonic sulfonic group chlorine will be at ortho position at ortho position or you can tell two carbon number two in with respect to so3 h two chlorobenzene okay and uh, it will be four chloro benzene that is para position that is a uh, major product okay then this i have told you about the electrophilic substitution reaction and like same way you can say friedel crafts reaction is there friedel crafts reaction means uh, in the presence of alcl3 methyl chloride suppose it is coming suppose chlorobenzene is there and now methyl chloride is coming then same situation will happen okay here again alcl3 will come alcl4 it will attract uh, it will attract cl minus methyl chloride uh, suppose methyl chloride or ethyl chloride is coming alkyl chloride suppose uh, it is coming near the chlorobenzene then cl will be that uh, ch3 and cl bond will break uh, and that cl will will go to the alcl3 it will come for short time alcl4 and ch3 will be plus that is a carbon that is again electrophile again same way it will attract either at ortho position or at para position means carbon number 2 or at carbon number 4 then it will give same way one chloro two methyl benzene one chloro two methyl benzene this is the minor and major will be one chloro four methyl benzene everywhere same things okay with respect to chlorine methyl is the second position or ortho position you can tell one chloro two methyl benzene minor and one four one chloro four methyl benzene is major this is actually feeder crafts reaction now another i am telling you that is the acylation acylation reaction same condition alcl3 is there but now uh, acetyl chloride is coming here acetyl chloride near the chlorobenzene means chlorobenzene plus acetyl chloride ch3 cocl ch3 cocl acetyl chloride co group is there ketonic group okay co group and uh, then here ch3 cocl is there then same way this uh, this cl of uh, ch3 cocl it will be attracted by alcl3 and ch3 co you will get plus you again you will get electrophile ch ch3 co then c c will have positive charge ch3 co positive charge cl is attracted by alcl3 for short period it will form alcl4 then here now again this ch3 co group will be attached with the either ortho or para hence it will form two chloro acetophenone minor product and major product will be four chloro acetophenone acetophenone and now you have seen that now this anhydrous chloride is taking for a short period cl then what will finally happen the finally happen means here what will happen to the finally this uh, alcl4 fourth one which is given by either acetyl chloride or methyl chloride into reaction what will happen to this then alcl4 is making then now when uh, methyl chloride will join with uh, ortho or para position then from that position h will be released as h plus then that h plus and this cl minus alcl4 was there then from that uh, h plus will attract to cl cl minus and other product hcl will form in both reaction correct means in both reaction with methyl chloride and with reaction with acetyl chloride okay 
and previously also same things happen because h is coming out then it will not like h plus correct it has you have i already told you it has joined with oh minus in previous two reaction i told you and it form water in case of uh, nitration and sulfonation then now uh, this uh, this reaction is there um, uh, two more reaction is there uh, i want to finish shortly will understand no problem that is a reaction with metals reaction with metals then here again you can see uh, this uh, hyaluronic means chlorobenzene as for example or x you can consider here what will happen now with with metal it will react like a sodium like with sodium it will react actually this reaction reaction with metals is called urge fitting reaction urge fitting re w u r t z urge fitting f i w t i g fitting reaction here what you will get means reaction is with metal in presence of r x means alkyl group a mixture of an alkyl halide and an aryl halide both are halide one is alkyl halide other is aryl halide aryl halide is example you can take as a halogen Chlor chlorobenzene 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 then a, a mixture of an alkyl halide and aryl halide alkyl halide means rx gives an alkyl arene with treat when treated with sodium in dry ether and is called urge fitting reaction now here main thing is that alk alkyl halide and aryl halide both are reacting and now both alkyl and aryl both will join means chlorobenzene x is there plus rx rx then what will happen that metal is there na na will attract the x it will form nax like nacl navr ni then x is coming out as x minus then that carbon will have a positive positive charge and here here r will come r will come as positive because rx is there rx is there then x will come as a x minus then r will have positive then this positive will go to the negative carbon of benzene then there it will there, there r will join then you will get benzene and r alkyl both will join that's why uh, you will get here alkyl arene this is called alkyl arene means benzene and alkyl group both joined and side product will be nax because na was metal was there and uh, x came out from the benzene benzene x was there that came out then it formed nax nax then he this is this type of reaction is called urge fitting reaction means with benzene benzene ring r has joined like methyl ethyl like that way and what is fitting reaction fitting then fitting reaction uh, i am telling you aryl halides aryl benzene ring hello hello benzene two molecule you can take now here both benzene will join to each other that is a characteristic two molecules of two molecules of aryl halide will react in presence of metal means sodium that also two na you can consider as a two na but it should be in presence of ether water should not be there then aryl halide also gives analogous compounds when treated with sodium in dry ether in which two aryl groups are joined together it is called fitting reaction means uh, two chlorobenzene two molecules of chlorobenzene will react 
in presence of 2n 2na 2na then 2na will require 2cl then when it will come x will come out as x minus the carbon will be carbon will be positive positive correct then or you can understand like that in a very easy way that 2na is there then 2na that n because it is atom sodium atom i am talking about then sodium atom will be very very reactive it is a, just like a free radical only active act, active atom you can tell in both cases sodium is metal active one electron they have then here sodium has two sodium has two sodium atom means two each have one one electron then here because it is just like a free radical then this bond will break uh, this benzene ring and x bond will break and both will take one one electron because one electron of sodium one electron of chlorine it will form nax then two 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 molecules are there and two sodium atoms are there and it will form 2 nax then each benzene has one one electron hence both will join and it will make a bond that is called diphenyl diphenyl both benzene join to each other then this reaction is called fitig reaction fitig reaction now i am stopping only here next class i will start other terms thank you